It's like a great Shandini. <laughs> Nikki Chapinski up here in this in this beast. We got to uh, give one more chance for any of you guys, people who is in the men's room masturbating. You might have been in the women's room masturbating, fellas. That's rude. Anyone who uh, didn't get a chance to buy a raffle ticket, you got one more shot. We're about to win some prizes. Yeah, indeed. My stage assistant here help us out. Now, of course, we all know about the grand prize. You'll notice that Barbie is a red shirt. She's dying. Now, uh, you'll notice that uh, William Shatner is checking out, Ken. And Spock's not judging, because he's a loving guy. You know what? The Star Wars action figures are twice as much of a cheapskate. Behold in all of its glory, America. with your singles right now, you still have a chance to win. We also have some other excellent prizes, but who gives a damn about them? Now, uh, has everyone got a chance to get their raffle tickets ready? Oh, we got someone who wants to buy some. All right, yeah, yeah, you will. There you go. Now go get more. Yes, indeed. Does anyone else, any other latecomers, want to get up on this prize train? We got a. Uh, oh, wait, we have to show them some more of the prizes. Why don't you show them what you got in your pocket there? That's right. This is a miniature bust of Mozart. Just in case you ever forget that he was born in 1756 and passed away in 1792. One. Confudiatis. Maledictus. That's right, you two can walk away with this lovely bust. If you don't like Mozart, you can paint over it. It could be Andrew Jackson. That's right, or just take any French person. They kind of all yell, you know, like, look, it's the bad guy from Beauty and the Beast. Anyway, prize number one, the Mozart. All right, here we go, right here. That's what she said. So we have ticket number 312. Last three digits are zero, seven, eight. Do we got a winner? Did the winner go home? Do we have it? We're looking at ticket zero, seven, eight. In the VIP section. In the VIP section, getting their money's worth. Come on down here, don't be shy. I gotta see the ticket. I'm not gonna believe you. You better get Star Trek Elvis. Take your time and get paid by the hour. Come on, hop to it. Don't you love classical music? It's alright if you see any performers back there, feel free to do so. Here we go. Can we, are you sure? Woo! All right, can I see the ticket? Do you have to, ma'am, do you have the ticket? Zero seven, oh my God, she has a matching ticket. Woo! You can put this at home on top of your piano. If you don't want to, if you don't have a piano, I'll sell you mine, I come with it. And you, thank you so much for coming out. Enjoy your prize, tell your friends, thanks for the ring. Now, I'm sure there's some Elvis fanatics here who will give way, way more than a dollar for this after you win it, so feel free to flip it. I won't get pissed. All right, we have ticket number 311. All right, no disappointment so far. Nine. Four. Five. Nine, four, five. We've got nine, four, five in this. In this his house. That's all right. Once again, that's 311. 945. 945. Who's got 945? 
Cheese. They're worth like a cent of a cent, whatever that is. 